Aiden gets doubled outside Trier. Jackson Cartwright penetrates the zone and kicks. And Dylan Smith is around and out with a three. A tap out. And a Trier triple. Got it. A lob for Chemezi Metsu. Able to corral it in traffic and they'll reset it. McLaughlin finds an open corner three from Matthews. And how at this point do you leave that guy that open? Aiton one on one with Metsu. The double comes. It doesn't matter. And one. You see the seams on the Wilson Jet. Stewart was left unmarked, and Arizona dodged a bullet there, but then they give it right back. McLaughlin off for Usher, reverses it in. Jordan Usher. Dipsy do, scooparoo. A joke. With Metu having two fouls, if I'm Arizona, go right at him and try and pick up his third. Even though they're in his zone, you can still isolate on Metu. Raleigh Alkins gives Arizona the lead. And an early timeout for Andy Enfield as Tucson North comes alive. Now it's Trier, shot clock winding down. Jackson Cartwright to Alkins, penetrates and feeds, and the foul! At the last moment, he found the big man who's got a chance at three. Good offense and good defense, Joe. Largest lead of the game for Arizona. In fact, largest lead of the game period is four. A lob for Chemezi Metu. That's what we spoke about earlier, Joe. Inside they go to Aiton. It's a cutting Hawkins who hammers it down over Stewart. And this place right now is ready to explode. It's Aiton. Out of sorts offensively. It began with the foul trouble in terms of Matthew over the top. Oh. Holy smokes. Aiton from Ristich. Timeout, USC. Ristich, a nice flash into the high post. Just throws it up to Aiton, his partner, like dancers. Terrific feel for one another, and of course, so fortunate that if you throw it anywhere up. Here's a lob for DeAndre Aiton, a man among boys. And this Arizona partisan crowd rises in Las Vegas for the third time in four years. Conference tournament champions, back to back conference tournament titles. This one perhaps the most satisfying yet for Sean Miller and Arizona. When you decided to come to Arizona, is this what you thought it would be like? Just yes, so you know, we don't want to really, I didn't come here to really uh, ride the coattails of the past players. I came here to make my own history, leave my own mark on the school, and you know, that's um, following those guys, so that's what I'm trying to do. This, the last two games were unlike anything I've ever seen. You tied your career high both nights with 32. How did you do it? Just playing hard. My teammates, my teammates really trusted my, my, my offense and defense. You know, I showed both uh, best effort on both ends of the floor, and I just executed and uh, did what Coach told us, told me to do. Is there a point in the second half where, I mean, you're getting the ball and you're just scoring every time. Did you feel unstoppable? I mean, I just knew it was going for me. You know, the ball <laughs> fell right, and, you know, I felt I've been working on my game, and, you know, hard work pays off. How does, how does Pac-12 champs sound to you? Pac-12, it was amazing. This is, this is a great feeling. You know, I can't stop smiling. My cheekbones hurt. You deserve it. That was amazing. Go enjoy it, DeAndre. Yes, sir. Thank you. DeAndre Aiden, just outstanding today, back-to-back. 32-point -back game.